All right. Um, so I don't even need this here. So this is a test. Um, I am testing the microphone. So someone, a couple of people are telling me that my mic was terrible, and that's yes because on the NVIDIA Shield controller, uh, it defaults to the microphone on the controller. So the, the, the controller has its own built-in microphone, and it's garbage. Garbage sounds so bad. You can hear clicks and stuff. <laughs> so what I'm going to show you here is uh, how to use a different mic. So you've got a couple of op options, okay? And I'll, I'll show you the options at the, at the last two options at the end. So option one is the controller itself. You can use it as a mic. It sucks, it's dumb, it's terrible. You'll hear it at the very end. The next option is using a set of earbuds. See? A uh, 3.5 millimeter earbud with microphone. And you can plug that sucker right into your NVIDIA Shield controller. I'll again, I'll show you that in a minute. And you'll figure out why it's blinking, okay? Alright, so right now you're actually hearing my audio from the third option, which is the built-in mic on my, on my microphone, not on my microphone, on my camera. I am sporting a Logitech camera, uh, which is uh, natively supported by the NVIDIA Shield. It supports almost all current generation models of Logitech. I don't know all of them, you're gonna to have to look at the FAQs or the forums, but um, the Logitech camera that I am sporting is a Logitech, Logitech HD Pro webcam, it's the C920. That's the one that I'm using, okay? That one is definitely uh, compatible. I will link this in the description. You can hear me clicking and stuff. I'm actually grabbing the product uh, link as we speak. So that has a built-in microphone. It's pretty good. As you can hear, it gathers all the sound in the area. It's kind of it's more like a uh, like a, a podcast kind of a thing. It's not like a direct cam. Uh, unfortunately. You can't plug in a USB microphone. I have got a Bluebell microphone, a Bell by Blue. This is what I use for the PC. And if you plug it in, which I'm going to do right now, you most likely will not hear a change in my voice. Plug it in. Light is on. You can See it? There you go. You can see the light. See, there's nothing. Uh, but if I go like this, and I go, you're probably going to hear that because that's the microphone on my camera. Okay? So that is the first option. Second option, unfortunately, this is not available. Uh, second option is to, as I already talked about, use the microphone on this. So the reason why this is blinking is because I have actually had to disable this. The only way that you can get your webcam to use its native microphone is if you disable your controller. It took me like an hour to figure this out. Let me explain. The only way you can get to the, the streaming page or the page where you can Gamecast or Twitchcast is with an NVIDIA controller. I have multiple controllers here. I've got a USB, uh, a USB wired uh, Xbox 360. I've got an Amazon Fire controller. I've also got another um, Razer uh, uh, Central, whatever it's called, Sentinel uh, controller. Uh, all of which I have tried to access the menu, but you can't. The only way to do it is is by pushing the circle home button on the NVIDIA Shield controller. 
shoot. Did it just connect? Frick. Uh oh, I think we lost. I think we lost some stuff. All right, so I'm going to go into it. So I'm going to show you here. I'm now going to enable it. So see how it's flashing? I'm going to push the button. It's going to connect. You'll see it connect. Okay. You'll probably hear the mic changed. It changed. I found that by plugging in the controller and holding it down till it blinks, it's blinking, it'll disconnect it, and now the mic will change. You probably heard it change. That's the only way that you're going to be able to get the good microphone from your webcam to work. Because otherwise, you're going to get this. Hear that? It's garbage. Okay. Uh, and then let's, let's go over the third and final way that you can use your headphones. Hopefully, it'll, it'll switch to the headphones uh, here that I've got. So... I'm going to plug this in. Here it is. There is the jack. I'm going to plug it in. You'll probably hear the mic threshold adjust. Now it's not making noise when I do this as much. And you'll be able to hear this. All right. Now I've got the headphones in and you can hear the mic from my uh, controller, but you'll probably notice it jitter or it, it choke. It all depends on what game you're playing. So I'm going to throw a game on here, maybe commute, um, maybe turn down the sound. Uh, it's, it's a little bit up. So you'll hear that. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, it busted. I, I busted the ring on there. That hurts my ear now. So now you can hear that. Um, but yeah, so anyway, um, those are the three options you've got. And uh, I'm going to show you now how to tell the NVIDIA Shield to play back the mic from your webcam. So first what you need to do is you need a second controller. That's all you need. So whether it's your wired or your Bluetooth enabled, you need a second one. And it needs to be connected, okay? So now what you need to do is you need to hold down the home button. You need to enable, you know, pull up the overlay of the stream. You then need, on your controller, hold down the green NVIDIA button. Wait until it disconnects. It flashes, let go. It'll disconnect. On the other controller, you now need to go activate it. Oh, this is great. Oh, this is terrific. It's not working now. Oh, good heavens. Uh, let's unplug this. We need to plug in. We can plug in the Xbox controller. So my, my, my Bluetooth isn't working. So anyway, uh, we plug in that controller. We dis disable, enable the mic. And now it should work, okay? But that's that. That's that's how you. Uh, it's my tutorial how you enable the mic on your webcam to work. If you like, if you like, subscribe if you want to see more. Andy Paul, stallgamesplayed.com, stallgamesplayed.com, stallgamesplayed.com.